Psalm 7, 12 through 16, agents of the TI program don't understand what they done got themselves into. But first, please help my humble channel to grow. Like, subscribe, share, comment, any combination thereof. Why? Because you're beautiful on the inside and on the outside. That's why. If a man does not repent, God will wet his sword. He has bent and readied his bow. He has prepared for him his deadly weapons, making his arrows fiery shafts. Behold the wicked man conceives evil and is pregnant with mischief and gives birth to lies. He makes a pit, digging it out and falls into the hole that he has made. That is for the agents of this program. They have dug a pit and they're about to fall into it themselves. His mischief returns upon his own head. I'm experiencing that now, meditating on God, being in God's con God's presence more and more continually, I get to see him doing to the agents of this program what they do to me, what they seek to do to me. And on his own skull, his violence descends. Many of them have tried to get physical with me. Many of them have become ill, sick, seizures, heat strokes, wind up being taken off into the hospital. You never see him again. So the reason I'm saying this is that not because the agents of this program, most of them are evil and they worship Satan and all this kind of stuff, because the Lord has made it clear to me that most of the folks who are participating in the TI program don't want to be participating in it, targeting us. They have been coerced and manipulated, pressured, etc. Some have even been brutalized to participate in the program. But if you go against them, they will more actively target you and then try to make that the justification for them targeting you because you dare to try to target them back. The Lord has stopped me from trying to target them back and take vengeance into my own hand. But the thing that they don't realize is that when you participate in this program, they, first of all, this program is intended for everyone. They want everyone to be a TI. The leaders, the globalist elites, they want everyone under their control down to their very thoughts. Mind Control Ultra, MK Ultra, that, that goes back decades. And that's what the TI program is. God has not given us a spirit of fear, but of power, love, and of a sound mind. So the whole thing with, with mind control, God will not allow them to take control of your mind and your thoughts. Yes, they can read your thoughts to a certain extent, not as good as God can, but they will not be able to control your thoughts because God will forbid it if the Holy Spirit Spirit of the Most High God dwells in you. But for those who participate in this program, this program is targeting them as well. This program considers that it owns them, that they are their property, that they have them under their thumb, that they have them under their complete control. And for those agents of the program who have dared to say, I'm not going to participate in this program anymore, the targeting, I don't mean to laugh, but the targeting that they experience is almost unbelievable. A few of them have gone online and talked about it because they consider once you participate at any level of this program, you are owned by them. And lastly, for those who enjoy this program and enjoy what it has to offer and enjoy the destruction that it leaves on people's lives, that, these scriptures that I read mostly applies to them. God bless.